The following is a short instructional video on the application of Colicare from Think and Tinker Limited in your spindle setup. Some basic safety precautions to observe while using Colicare. Always wear gloves while handling Colicare. Do not ingest Colicare. Most important, always use Q-tips to apply Colicare to the actual spindle. Do not wrap a towel around your finger and stick your finger into the turning spindle. Step 1. Cleaning the spindle. Turn the spindle on. Using the wet end of the Q-tip, apply even moderate pressure to the inside of the bore, taking a down and outwards motion to pull dirt out and fling it away from the mouth of the spindle. Then turn the Q-tip around to the dry side, and again using moderate even pressure, polish up and down repeatedly to evenly distribute the collet here on the inner surface. Step 2. Cleaning the collet nut. With a fresh Q-tip, wet the end with one or two drops of the collet care. With the collet nut in hand, reach to the inside of the nut, wet end first, and using moderate even pressure in a circular motion, clean first the front taper, followed by the extractor groove, followed finally by the threads. Flip the Q-tip around to the dry end, and repeat the process, drying first the front taper, followed by the extractor groove, and finally by the threads. Step 3. Cleaning the collet. Take a cotton or microfiber cloth and wrap around the end of your thumb. Apply one or two drops of collet care to the surface of the cloth. Taking the collet in hand, use your thumb to apply moderate even pressure to the surface of the collet. Wiping collet care across the back taper and front taper of the collet. Try to wipe parallel to the curve cuts in the collet to prevent fibers being torn from the cloth. Once you've completed the wash down with Colicare, switch to a dry region of the cloth and wipe the Colicare to evenly distribute it across the surface of the collet. The following are additional considerations to take into account when using Colicare. For any of the cleaning steps, if the process results in a dirty Q-tip, repeat that process until the Q-tips come out perfectly clean. This ensures that all dirt has been removed from your collet and spindle. Always use fresh Q-tips and towels in between cleaning steps and process iterations, changing these as often as needed. Also, new spindles and collet assemblies will typically require several cleanings fresh out of the box, due to any lubricants or protective coatings that manufacturers apply to these components before shipping.